What's good everybody, AKB for I here. So we have another B-pop today. It has almost 40 million views in about a week. That's insane. So I could look up the name on Google Translate or some other method of finding out how to pronounce it, but that's kind of cheating for me. I'm getting into V-pop, so I'm gonna butcher it and learn it on my own and by your help in the comments. So I do apologize for this butchering. Let me know how off I was down below and if you've heard anything worse. So, okay, there's, give me a sec. Nugu oi la oi oi. I bet you it's not even remotely pronounced like that, but that's not the point. The point is, is that I tried. This is by the Super Brothers, awesome name, Carrick and Orange, the color orange. This has been brought to you by the color orange. Anyway, let's check this out. It has 40 million views. It must be for a good reason. Oh, okay. We're opening up with one of those shots. Transition from black, the shutters. That's beautiful. Is that Vietnam? Oh, hello. You don't look like a super brother. Yo, I like that jacket. That's swag. Oh, this isn't really V-pop. It's like V-hip-hop? Oh, hi. So hearing rap in different languages is very interesting. It's like, are they visiting like a farm town? Oh, this is everything. Oh my God, I understand now why it has 40 million. I guess super brothers are the EDM, Carrick's the rapper and Orange is the singer girl. This is amazing because the scenery Tells its own story. Someone who's just away from everything, trying to figure themselves out. So V-Pop's EDM section knows where it's at. And her voice is so powerful too. She's fierce looking too. Fierce women are the best. <laughs> that was incredible. Oh wait, you're just gonna walk away? You're gonna leave your tent there? You're gonna leave the kettle running? You're not even gonna sit down for a cup of tea? Are you that upset? I'll take the cup of tea, bring it over here. There isn't really much necessary needed to say, except for the fact that V-Pop is sneaking up on me with all this hype. I have no template, so I don't know what to expect from it. So the fact that I'm starting to get an idea, and this is a very sparse idea because of the fact that I've only seen like three V-Pop videos ever, um, is they have a very traditional sound of EDM. And when I say traditional, something that is traditional now. Like I hear a lot of tracks that have that style, but they do it so differently because it's just really there to really build on top of the vocals that you hear of both Carrick and Orange, which I still don't know who is who. So I'm gonna pretend that I know what I'm talking about. And Orange is the girl's name and Carrick is the guy rapper because or she, the girl was wearing orange. Anyway, the point I'm saying is, this style of music is one that I think many audiences can enjoy. Me, I come from an EDM and a rap background. Like, I really love those two, so I can appreciate Orange's vocals because of just the sheer power behind it. But what really gets me to stay is the rap and the synthesizers behind it. And I'm not trying to downplay Orange because her voice is fantastic. I, uh, it's just so good. I'm still getting used to how Vietnamese rap is. Every language introduces its own version of flow with rap. So with this comes a new territory of, for me anyway, one, not knowing Vietnamese rap and two I don't know Vietnamese so it's really interesting because they did actually have the lyrics in Vietnamese for me to kind of read along try to follow how things are supposed to be pronounced versus how he is flowing with them because Having flow sometimes means bending how words are actually supposed to pronounce so you could fit whatever flow you're going for. So that's just another challenge I have to go with, but overall it's an amazing song and it really just goes to show you that music does transcend language. It's just that you have to use the tools that you got, which in this case is Vietnamese. But the power behind Orange's vocals are the same as if she was a great singer born in any other country. And that's what I love about international music. You just find talent from everywhere besides America for me since I'm American. Or people like Dua Lipa, let's go this was phenomenal and I want to see more of this and I want this to expand just like Korean music is in the Western world I want this to be right there with it as well as anything else I react to thank you guys so much for watching I really do appreciate it and if you like the video please leave a like and subscribe it really really helps and until next time peace